Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Cranky Pundit Podcast. I'm your host, Mike Morgan, the Cranky Pundit. It's the quiz, folks. I'm joined by Psychic Dan. Psychic Dan, how are you? Really good, man. Thanks for having me. No about it. How was your week? Good, boy. Good. A flu. I can't believe a week is yeah, boy. One Went of those quick. ones. Went quick. But One you know what? Ones. As Liverpool fans, we have to address the elephant in the room, folks. And uh, even if you don't follow football, like like my man was even saying it to me, Jesus, it must have been awful, was it? <laughs> I see. 5-2 was yeah. a very bad. <laughs> I was like, yeah. yeah, it was awful. Liverpool lost 5-2 to Real Madrid. And you know what? Like, there's still this little Liverpool boy inside me. There's this 11-year-old boy inside me that's saying Liverpool can still go through. They're saying he's still screaming out, going, do you yeah. know what? If Camavinga goes over the top on Jota there in the first minute, down oh. to 10 men, we're tuning it up at halftime. You never <laughs> love Oh, uh, no, but it's not going to happen. Do you know what? I think a couple of years ago when Barca happened, I think, you know, we, uh, we had the team, even though, like, we had the spirit, we had all that, like, you could see it could happen, like, but... Yeah, and I think the difference as well between that Barca team and this Real Madrid team is that like the, the, they're a counter-attacking team, like like, like Vinicius and Rodrigo. Like they like we're gonna have to come out at them, knowing the yeah. Bernabeu, and they're probably gonna rip us to shreds. If, if anything, it could be it could, could be get worse. Very embarrassing. Could get like, worse. But, like, but yeah. still, we're Liverpool. You know? Yeah, yeah. No, I feel the same. I think they've given us so many of those nights. <laughs> yeah. You have to think <laughs> there's a chance. Like, do, do you know in Harry Potter? Did you ever watch Harry Potter? Oh, you seen a few of them. All right. Okay. So in Harry Potter one. Um, is that the Chamber of Secrets? I think it could be. Or the Philosopher's Stone. Anyway, Harry Potter won. They have a sorting hat, you know? Mm. And the hat tells you what house you're going to be in. Like. Yeah, yeah. Like, you, be, you could be Gryffindor, I'd say. You pa- I, I'm, yeah. I'm a Hufflepuff. I've been told I'm the most Hufflepuff person anyone's ever met. Right, right? what's a trait of someone that goes to Hufflepuff? That's, do you know what I mean? Soft as shit. Right. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, don't bother with nothing. Like, do you know what right. I mean? Just happy to be there, boy. Happy, right. to, happy to be going to Hogwarts. Like, right. Do you know what I mean? That kind of stuff. Right. Slithering, self-explanatory. Yeah, yeah. Or a snake. But yeah, you'll yeah. get to the top. You'll have a good business yeah. plan, but you're a slimy snake. Yeah. Gryffindor's brave and fucking going for it. Oh, thanks very much. No bother, kid. And Ravenclaw, I think that means you're kind of book smart. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah. I, I could be wrong. Or, by all means, comment mm. in if I'm wrong about this, but that's what I think it is. Is there anyone book smart? And also has common sense. Like, <laughs> do, don't, do, don't, do, <laughs> well. like, don't you normally say, like, isn't book smart the term you normally use when someone is actually kind of stupid? Like, you wouldn't be but street they're, smart. They're very, <laughs> ac- they're very yeah. academic. Do you know, like, and we went to school with fellas there, and, like, like at school, they're way better than me, like. <laughs> but the moment they walk out the door, kid, they'd be lucky to get home. Do you know what I mean? And, like, they'd be getting A's and A1s and all this and that. But, like... <laughs> bring them out around for half an hour there like and, <laughs> and like they'd be lost so, they'd be lost socially they're the ones getting absolutely done like yeah. you know what I mean yeah like, so yeah I, that's a good question yeah. that's a good question so you, you, what you're saying you probably least like to be in Ravenclaw out of all of them I suppose by the sounds of a kid so what I was trying to say anyway is that if if you supported a club and the sorting hat had to had to sort what club I think it's part of a trait as a Liverpool fan to just have blind belief and hope at some point like that. Yeah, do you know what? Yeah. We can do. You have to have that never give up attitude, I think. And that's what attracted mm. me to Liverpool as a club. But this might be a bridge. This is a bridge way too far. We're gone. We're out. We're out of every competition. Probably yeah. won't even qualify for top four. That's bleak. But uh, what I just want to touch on the game, I know it's been covered by everything. And you don't come here to get your facts to say in Sky Sports News. This is raw emotion. like. Um, Joe Gomez, Daniel. Joe Gomez. Oh, dude. So we had a fast conversation last week and we were like, oh, but look how young he is. Look at the age of him. And like, this. And we, we gave Joe Gomez every excuse <laughs> we could last week, the two of us. Like, we were like, we came up with all the excuses for the man. And um, not his shies, kid. Yeah. Like, he can't be a part of it going forward. No. And you know what? Like, I don't even want him looking at Seller. Yeah. I don't even. I be, I was like, don't yeah, even yeah. look at him, boy. Yeah, yeah. Jinx. Yeah, like everything the man done the other night was wrong, mm. and every goal we conceded for the last about month, I'd say, has somehow gone through Joe Gomez. Yeah. Um. Even his touches, his passing, his decision making, it's yeah. all gone. You can't go that bad, but it's confidence, lad. Confidence. But you is know, what, you know the thing with him is, like, was he ever that good? Like, I know he played a few good games for us, but like, I think he'd one period where he was good for us. Um, when when Matip was injured. And he was next to Van Dyke for a while. But uh, in general, I don't know, has he ever really shown? Like, any man that's played 200 odd games and still hasn't scored a goal, there's questions over. Like, <laughs> yeah. Because if you took his pace off him, he's never scored a goal in his life and he can't really defend. So if you took his pace off him, he's about my goal kid. Yeah. Do you 
you know what I mean? Yeah. He's about my <laughs> standard, like, do you know? Like, yeah, fair enough. I don't know. I get what you're saying. It's emotion. That's what I'm saying, folks. We were praising the men last week. Oh, <laughs> no, like. Dan's, he's yeah. As he's about my standard. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing what a week does, lad. Yeah. Football, boy. Yeah. Oh, lad. Oh, I was head wrecked with a lot of them. I looked at their starting lineup. I was like, is Danny Calvahel still starting right back for them? Get at him, right? Oh, I, don't know if I, I don't know if I told you this that last week, but uh, Danny Carvajal has like mm, 400. Medals. It's 400. I get, he's every 17 games he's lifted a trophy, yeah, kid. Yeah. Like, there is a career of the man. Part of the furniture, though. Like, as in, like, uh, like they could have found someone. Like, I want him. That was the reason I'll say it. But, uh, no, class player, class player. But, like, he's but at it now a while. Like. He's more Champions Leagues than most clubs, like. That's true. But so does Kovacic. So does... Yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? A lot yeah. of players that played for To Real be League. fair, do you know what, kid? He wouldn't be bad for Liverpool. Oh, like. I'd love Kovacic yeah, for Liverpool. Yeah, yeah. Do you know what, I'm, what am I talking about? Yeah. He proved at the World Cup, box-to-box, box, energy, pressing. He just might be too... Maybe hitting his 30s now. Might, might be too late. But, um... Yeah, do, I was disappointed with Robbo basically not getting at Danny Calvahel um, at that side. I thought anything good yeah. we did was in the first half and it was down Trent Henderson and Salah's side, you know? Yeah. Like, I know Nunes scored a goal, but like... Other than that, though, don't get me wrong, no, a couple of goals recently, so we'll praise him for that. Yeah. Keep them coming, dude. But other than the goal the other night, dude, he was anonymous, though, yeah. wasn't he? Yeah. Like, he done, he'd no other effect in the game. And when you've, like, an 80 million player or you've, like, these big characters in the team up top, like, they're the boys you need to pull you out of those yeah. situations. Yeah. When you get go us down, two goals. That's it. When you go down 3-2-4-2, two, two, they're the boys you want to get the ball and run 50 yards with it. And, do you know what I mean? Like, and, and he just, I think, after the goal, there was no more of him. It's hard to be hard with him now because he has scored recently and he does look a bit better. Um, but uh, we're cooked. We're cooked. We're like done. It's hard to watch. Yeah, it's like watching. Do you know? I don't know. A good, a good fighter that you love just getting hopped off, just punch drunk. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Years past his prime, he's doing it for yeah. the money, and like he's just getting flogged, throwing the towel. Boy, I don't even <laughs> want to watch. Boy, do you know, hundred percent. Like the one thing you say for the last few years is that like any team that beat us deserved it. Like it was, it was hard work to beat us. But like that third goal the other night, like the the free kick on the edge of the box, yeah. like. If it Come happened on. down the park with yeah. Youngfellas kids, you'd lose your life. Yeah. Like, do you know what I mean? Like Liverpool. Every one like, of them standing still. This is uh, last on a last 16. Line. Too and Joe Gomez has a look over his shoulder before the free kick and senses no danger. Yeah, he gave like, away the free sen- kick because yeah, it came over no and clung danger. him. Like. That's it, yeah. Yeah. And uh, How do you, what do you think of Gekpo? Um, do you know what, dude? I, I again know like you'd be on about time, but I am. Um, I think he actually might. He could be a decent number nine, like. Do you know what I mean? Like, do you know the way we kind of, like, what do they call it? The false line is what they call it. Like, what Bobby's been doing yeah, for yeah. years. I think he could do Bobby's job. Like, what Bobby's been doing for years, I think he could do. Um, but I just, he's, he just hasn't turned up yet, really. Yeah, not really. Like, yeah, like Newcastle was, like, it was actually, I, I left, I, when the fi- full-time whistle went, I was actually more sad than happy about it. Like, you know, I was like, Jesus, we did for 10, yeah. 10 men, done 11 men for yeah. 70 minutes. Like, you know. Yeah, that does happen though, doesn't it? It does, yeah. It's Do spirit know? and like you have to put less in, I suppose. Yeah, I totally get it. I totally get it. Look, disaster of a time for Liverpool. Um, Do you know what? Getting knocked out knowing the way we've got knocked out, we might go on a bit of a run and get top four. You wouldn't know. Like, yeah. but I don't know. But we just don't seem good enough and Klopp ain't yeah. going to switch it up. We've already talked about, everyone's talking about formation, tactics for the last few months. He's clearly not going to really change that much. Like, he's not like, like Trent at right back, like like he did some amazing things in the first half. But at the end of it, Vinicius actually went by him and he just stood, he was standing mm. still just watching him. Mm. Like Vinicius, you could tell every time, like it's it's world oh, news now. Like licking you his could, lips. You could tell every time he got it, like it's like, I'm going to go at him every yeah. time, like every yeah. single time. like And he did. Do you know? Yeah. No, he is some player. Oh, like Vinicius, lad, like. oh yeah. But even, it, like, oh, they go through the goals. The first goal he scored, Vinicius, it was a decent goal. Joe Gomez didn't get out close enough to him. Like yeah. uh, Joe Gomez was the cast of the free kick. Um, well, the second goal was Allison then for the third goal, and then th- for the second goal, yeah. and the third goal then was Joe Gomez gave away the free kick, yeah. didn't pick up your man from Arkin. Yeah, uh, fourth goal deflected it off Joe, go- Joe Gomez, and then do you know the way in the first half when Van Dyke there was like a two on one and Van Dyke lad he came over I think it was Vinicius was away lad and he jogged back and he settled the whole ship lad you remember he he, he yeah, caused yeah. the two of them yeah, yeah. the same situation for the last goal happened Joe Gomez lad and he didn't press and he didn't go Mark yeah, Benzema yeah, like. yeah, yeah. you either go and you fucking clang him or you yeah. go back and do that Van Dyke had the perfect balance like you know of yeah. making him he forced your men into the wrong decision where Joe Gomez was like what are you going to do because I'm going to react to whatever you do I'm just going to react yeah, yeah, yeah. do you know yeah. Um, but yeah fuck it it's all over kid yeah it's hard to take boy I, we'll do well now to get fourth and, and 
I think all Liverpool fans know take four plus. Yeah, and just have f- a good summer and clear out a lot of shit, man. 100%. Yeah, we won't go on about it. We talk it, about it every week. Yeah, we yeah, should yeah, go. Just, like. just go. Just go. Yeah. Everybody go. Like. Dude, the harder part is, is who, who's going to come in. Yeah. Like we're all saying Bellingham, but give us he, more. Yeah. Name another three players. Yeah, because we need them. Name another six players, kids. You know, we're leaving as like, a joke. Like, yeah. And the amount that we bank on are getting too old. Like Salah, like. Like he was good yeah. there first 20 minutes the other night, like, but after yeah. that, lad, yeah. do you know? Like, and that's been the case for a long time now, like, do you know? Yeah. Um, but yeah, that's the case. Liverpool fans are hiding now, aren't we? We're kind of going into hiding a bit. Big yeah. time. We're going, I just, especially because United are doing so well. Do you know, you yeah, could see yeah. good things happening. Like your man Martinez, your man Casemiro. It's like Gas all the he got for being small as, yeah. as a centre back, but you know, Ten Hag seems to be getting away with it. Yeah, he looks unreal. I've seen t- even Ten Hag. I seen him with yeah. getting a picture with a baby, like, and the baby is ah, and he was ah, ah ha ha. Like even babies love this man, like, you know what I mean? It's a good vibe. Like I couldn't imagine Van Hell yeah. doing that, like, you know. No. All they probably would. All they'd mind your baby for the night if you asked him, I'd say. <laughs> you know, he's one of those type of dudes, like, you know. Seems uh, to be getting like obviously getting the best out of Rashford as well, like, and um, like a year ago there, I'm sure we even mentioned on the pod, like that dude didn't look interested. I thought yeah. he was finished. He looked and with life. Yeah, yeah. He looked like I uh, just like yeah. we'll find him in the river one yeah, of these yeah. days, like if you yeah. don't cop himself on, like. But yeah. delighted. I'd say Ronaldo, um, not having a good manager for fucking five years to develop him, and he's getting older than gone. Yeah. Careers wasted, like That's with it. these clowns, like you know. Yeah. Um, but I'm delighted it's working out well for him. Well, I wish it was with a different club, but w- he seems decent, like. Um, yeah. But yeah, Cup he's a savage player. Kid. Cup final this weekend will be very nostalgic yeah. for Come all on, the Newcastle. For all the, the, the older Premier League pl- um, watchers because yeah. Newcastle United was obviously always a massive game. The last final Newcastle played was against United, wasn't it? 98. Whoa. Yeah. Like, um, and possibly going to see Carrius in goal. Oh, I hope so, just for like watching it. Like, you know, mm. It'll just add to the affair. Like, you know, yeah. I hope he plays well at but wouldn't it be funny if he made an, <laughs> an <laughs> absolute shocker? Like it's going to happen, and they've no one to bring on if he does. I'd say. Yeah. What can he do? Like I'd say if I was if I th- if I was a bet man, no, I'd say he'll go the other dude. Whoever he, he is. Yeah. Whoever the other dude is. <laughs> Mister Random. He's just p- presented two sheets. One's Carrier's profile, and one's a, like a question mark with a guy's <laughs> face. <laughs> oh, that guy. Honestly, lad, you can't. Not in the final, boy. Not in the final. You can't start this man. Like I like I was saying earlier. He tell you himself. Carrius would tell you himself, you go, coach, if you want to win, don't start me. Like, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. Don't. Like, I'm only just, oh, I'm not even over the last one. People throwing shit at me every day over it. Like, you know, I often w- wonder, I feel sorry for him, what it's like driving around to be Carrius. Ca- Carrius? Yeah. Yeah. Do you know? But you told me he thinks he's a model. Like, or oh, is he a he model? He is a model. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, he's a good looking chap. Yeah. So he probably has other things going on for him. Yeah, yeah. Do you know? Yeah. Football is probably a side hustle for the men. Side hustle, like a hundred grand a week he took yeah. off his link. Yeah. Sniff. And he was always Shizer. Do you know someone wrote loser on his girlfriend's car thinking it was his car? <laughs> they woke up like to, like it was spray painted, but it was his girlfriend's car. <laughs> I bet he felt like some Egypt. Like, so <laughs> yeah. and it, was, it was spelt wrong as well. It was like Lasser. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he must go down. I, I, uh, he was probably the worst clap signing, obviously, wasn't he? There was no one as bad as him. Yeah. But yeah, he cast us lords. Yeah. Like, yeah. You could yeah. hide Nebby shitness to yeah. a certain extent. There's no hiding carriers. No, nah, in goals. Like, what do you do? Like, again, I put up a podcast there recently and um, I said Carrius was the worst player for Liverpool in the last 10 years. The amount of kids commenting, how can you just put him in there for one last game? Obviously, kids don't have that deep a voice, I'm imagining. Like, you know, <laughs> that's their tone. Like, <laughs> how can you put Carrius in goals? He only had one bad game. I'm there to these kids. I goes, listen to me, a clone. How, where's he now? <laughs> where's he now? Four choice for Newcastle. Yeah. Besik tested didn't take him. He was our fifth choice goalkeeper and our goalkeeping coach only worked with four goalkeepers. So we told him like to stay at home and we still yeah. paid him like, do you know, he's one, he's the worst player of all time. Stop feeling sorry for these dudes as well. Like, like feel sorry for him on the day. Feel sorry for the fans that went over, had to remortgage the house to go book a hotel and that fell at Butterfingers. And then he came out months later and said he was concussed. Do you remember that? Yeah, I, d- I do, but yeah. Like, that's the thing. It wasn't just one goal. It was two, wasn't it? Yeah. It was the first and the, tor- or first and and the, the second. Third. Yeah, Bales. No, what? But one of Bales was the best goal I ever seen in the Champions League. Yeah, League's yeah, the boys the other, Yeah, the boys club. My brother actually says that he should have got to that. I don't think so. Like, I, I've watched that a thousand times. There's no getting to that. That's just one of the best goals ever, I'd say. But then again, it's him and goal. I'd like to see Allison in goals for it. Like, he probably would have just caught it with one hand, maybe. Yeah. You never know. Like. Yeah. yeah. No, it's it's painful and scars, but you have scars over the men. Um, come here there's actually some news just to switch subject there there's uh, some news coming out in Ireland uh, this week that they're talking about um, giving police guns lad 
They're not. Yeah, boy. They voted against it, like, but what do you, what do you make of it? Do you think they should have it? Oh, absolutely not, boy. Absolutely not. Are you going stone mad? <laughs> as if the boys don't have enough power as it is and it don't go to their heads that's, enough. That's what I'm saying. And like. you want to give them guns? Yeah. Forget about it. Look, forget about it. Look at the poor soul up the country that had a gun there a few months ago and, and, and was, and he, like, where's he now? Like, yeah. like, you can't be doing that. Yeah. You can't be doing that. Um, if you if you give Garda, Gardaí guns, first of all, I know guards, they're lovely people. They're lovely people. But I don't, I wouldn't trust most of them with a spoon. Yeah. And the second, that's I don't think they want that responsibility. And second of that's all, um, like, it's yeah, not that I wouldn't trust them. I trust them, but it's just like, don't bring that on us. And some of them are running for the power, not the ones yeah. I know. The ones I know are lovely. But most, ga- not most guards, some guards in Ireland have a power trip. If you hand him a gun, yeah. it's all over. Can you imagine being yeah. at a checkpoint? Your tax is out of date. Come yeah, here. Yeah. <laughs> Put your mouth in the pistol there, <laughs> and, ta- and I'll talk to you about your tax. Well, it's like this now, young boy. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you have ten days to produce that in the garden station of your choice. Or it'll be the last thing you swallow. Do you hear me? <laughs> Go on home to your mother now. Tell me what I was asking for. That's what's going to happen. We can't have that. Or even a taser kid. People will be queuing up yeah. mouldy on Patrick Street. Give us a go after taser kid. Yeah. Give us a go after taser. Oh, I can take a lords. I can take a lords. <laughs> thirty seconds on the taser. Can you last long on thirty seconds on the taser? <laughs> <laughs> nah, it'd be a fucking joke, kid. Oh, you That's can't so give him that power, boy. No. Where's the army at, boy? I hate giving the army a doing. And, and people get on to me. I had to delete a video one time. I was slagging the army, boy. I had to delete it. Like, so much hate on it. I was like, it's not even worth kids looking at this language. I, 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 I'll take them on. I'll repost it. Um, but yeah, it's just like, yeah. No, Dude, they, they, they're allowed guns. And I know people in the army as well. They're two tiers below the, uh, the guards I know. <laughs> and, they, yeah, yeah. and they're... They used, like, you know, they don't yeah. do it anymore. But, like, remember they used to just mine things going into ATMs? They'd just be there, a young fella with fucking mm. red red face, like, not shaking. I remember, like. I remember I was going over to some random no, but I remember I was going over to a Liverpool game in the 90s, kid. And uh, there was still tension, boy. There was still tension in the air, like, with Ireland and England back then, like. And uh, we got off the plane over there, boy, and we had to walk through. Like, they'd have the army there, like, the boys all, like, gunned up, kid, massive yokes, like, and, like, a tunnel of them, lad, either side, like, you're walking in through the airport and the Irish planes, and you'd have to walk down through market, the most intimidating entrance to a country you could ever get, <laughs> especially as a child, like, yeah. do you know what I mean? And, um, because yeah. thi- things England. were still hot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ivan Drago. Um, but our boys, like, for starters anyway, why do they need them? Like, because what they have is perfect, isn't it? This is the, like, the, like, obviously we need someone with guns, like. We can't have none of them with guns, like. Yeah. We need someone with them, like. Because, I mean, if, like, what are they, like, they, you know what I mean? You have to, like. But given the normal jaw soap out in the road, hiding behind the wall, kitchen, someone going 31 kilometers yeah. an hour, give that clown a gun. Yeah. Forget it, boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Forget yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Hopping into the car going after fellas Forget that were, they were yeah. doing 80 and a 60, like. Yeah. Bless us, like, you know. You're dead right, boy. No, nah, well, can't be having that. That's a joke. Don't even have that conversation. I, I, I get into. I, 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 I want to join the the guards. Do you? Yeah. Do you think you'll be good at it? Yeah. I think I'd be great at it, boy. Do you? Yeah. But you'd have our life to do is fucking just. You know or, what or, I mean? or if you get a gun, like if I get that, or if I get a gun, gun? Without or the without gun? no, like the speed gun, I'm on about. All right. If I, if I'm just chilling at the side of the roads with speed guns, yeah. I'll do that. Easy peasy. I'll call out the places and go. Don't know. Can we do anything about that? Do you know You're what? better off now. Did you did you leave the window open? <laughs> so what can we do if you left the window open? Yeah, no, they like I I don't have anything against the I have a description, fingerprints, his mother's name. Yeah, I, have yeah. a, I have a semen sample. Yeah, yeah. I don't think there's anything we're gonna be able to do about that. Did he have uh, did he have no NCT on his yeah, car per yeah. chance? Oh, we're yeah. on him. <laughs> a day NCT. Oh, you're going doing hard time, boy. Yeah. yeah, I think so. I think so. Charming at checkpoints, I would say. Yeah. You owe the tax. That's no bother. Yeah. <laughs> Give me your tenner. Give me your tenner when I say not. Yeah, yeah, I could see you being corrupt already. Corrupt? Yeah. I'm corrupt already and I've no power at all. Yeah. Like, corrupt already. Yeah. Do you know? I'll, um, I only, can only imagine the stuff I do, lad. Can only yeah. imagine. Like if I get, do you know, herbal tea, if I walk in on, let's say, 100 kgs of herbal tea, do you know, it's coming home. It's coming home. My, it's coming home. Yeah. Do you know, I, I can't. I can't yeah. put that into the evidence room. Do you know? 
Um, yeah, what about cold hair cash? Like you cold hair you, cash? You, you're giving all that up. There will be my my P forty five will be handed. Is that what you <laughs> hand in when you're done? <laughs> Just say I fucking can't cope with the stress of being yeah. a guard. A I'm day actually, after finding two hundred uh, grand. Yeah, yeah, I can't do it by the stress of it. By um, yeah. I'm going away. I'm actually going moving to Malaga, Seville. Yeah, yeah, just gone. I think it'd be good for my health chief. Um, as a detective, I think I'd enjoy it. Yeah, I think I think there's better countries to be a guard in than Ireland. You know, like there'd be a more action, and there'd probably be. I don't think so. I think it's the best country to be a guard in. I I, I think I think if if you got posted out in some village in West Kerry, I'd say after six months you go mad kid you go mad like I'd start planting shit in people I'd be so yeah, bored yeah. You that's know what, what happens yeah yeah that's what happens, that's what happens. very quick <laughs> <laughs> very quick what kind of shit would you plant like <laughs> where were we talking goods. West Kerry Stolen West goods. Kerry yeah, I'd be yeah. taking a cold moving into another farmer's yeah, field yeah. marked I won't even tell him about it let yeah, him ring me yeah yeah did he tell you to my cold you're painted on him number one the green cone mine and I'd be like hmm just a great drama yeah yeah planting a shotgun do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like they have shotgun out, uh, shotguns out there. Like, yeah. do you know what I mean? Fuck Kerry football. I'll write in the. I'll I'll, write, I'll spray paint in the town centre. Do you know what I mean? Something like that. Get the people going. Yeah. It'll be a kid. Crime will go up yeah. when I'm the sheriff of that town, boy. Yeah. Did you, did you? Did you? When you were a child, did you do any of those mischievous games when you were like around the place, like, um, not terrorising people, but like, do you know what I mean? Knock a tower and stuff. Yeah. Sure you played that. Like. Terrorise people as well. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's fun terrorising. Like, there's no one getting harmed there. Like, oh yeah, I wasn't physically harming anybody, but eggs, carrots, and exhaust pipes, jar yeah. marmalade, jar marmalade, jar marmalade. What's that, boy? Out of eggs. <laughs> 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 whatever you can get your hands on it was the early noughties folks yeah. yeah go on did you play those games yeah yeah of course yeah, yeah. I mean there's doing your own house like <laughs> <laughs> running around the back <laughs> yeah. talking about actual kids games can you remember Tip the Cane no I, I've heard of it what is it dude best game ever I was only thinking about this this week kid, right so one person is on right and let's say there's a place you have to come back and touch like this table right okay. but it'd be outside and at night right and there could be like 10 people playing one person has to go find everybody and then your job as the person hiding is to just touch the cane so the dude's got tactics like he can either hang tight and wait for people to come to him or just go out in the dark and oh try to find people, right? you know? it's what a game dude I would, I, I'd, I'd happily play it now as an adult so if I anyone else there wants a game of tip the cane let us know because we get that going. I, I'm going to get that going I'll yeah. play that as an adult we, that, that, that should, should be, be a sport that should be a thing like yeah, meet up yeah. meet up and in Donald Park uh, let's, let's all go play uh, tip during, the the su- during the summer and we're playing tip the can in 100%. the forest I, so I mean, I'd be all over kid. I'd be like, in camouflage gear laying in the lake just yeah. laying in the river yeah. like <laughs> fucking <laughs> tadpole <laughs> shit all over me like just fucking getting well into it but fucking what's the alkoi alkoi all over me by yeah. alki and all snorkel like you know? <laughs> yeah. breathe near bubbles like, by the door. whole thing like do you know what I mean <laughs> in it like you know Man's in tactical gear, like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, tip the king, kid. No, I what see. a game, dude. Yeah. What a game. Like, you've adults out there. I play could only play games that you could play by yourself, like. Yeah. <laughs> yeah <laughs> You're yeah. on many kids around yeah, this neck of the woods, yeah. like, that wanted to play with me. Yeah. So, I, I would tip the king by yourself. No good. Doesn't. Do you doesn't, ever play doesn't. Corb? <laughs> <laughs> but you know, you'd see adults. You'd see adults playing, like, um, games that you'd say, Jesus, like, do adults find that entertaining? Like, um, tag rugby. Like, I mean, that's, like, that's fucking laughable. Like, isn't <laughs> it, it sounds fun, boy. Tag no? rugby. Yeah, boy. No, I can play rugby. Do you, do you no, tag him, like? I play it along. Oh, do you hear this? Actually, I know I've got a couple of people that play tag rugby up in Cork, or is it like, for, anyway, if the girl scores, it's worth more points. And, and, go- and, like, and, and you know are the girls happy with that yeah, yeah. Like I, 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 get- I wanna know cause any girl you know like if you told them that like they'd literally they'd take offence that, that you're giving them more points like. yeah. so I wanna know the girls turning up to that like uh, how happy are they yeah, with yeah. that I think I mean? if a girl scores they get 7 points and if a boy scores they get 5 points if uh, someone gender fluid scores you know they like- get 11 points I saw this during the week right and I was like I- I'm definitely wrong about this but I still couldn't get my head around it so Tiger Woods got caught passing Justin Thomas um, a, a ten point because he he was saying couldn't drive as far as him. Boys had a little joke. <laughs> that is funny. It's funny, kid. <laughs> it's funny, right? <laughs> to look into the, to actually open the hand. <laughs> he brought plan, that like, out with him. Like. And the fact it's Tiger Woods, <laughs> you've no right to be driving the ball the same as him. Like, yeah, yeah. he's the greatest golfer ever graced the game. Like, yeah. so 
And then obviously there was a big backlash and, and I was reading this thing from some, I don't know, is she a female golfer or was she just a journalist or what was going on? And uh, she was on about how like it's a disgrace and that like because he was suggesting that he could only drive a ball as far as a woman could and not as far as him. And I was like, but if it's true, is it a disgrace? Like women get a different tee box, like. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So like you can't drive the ball as far as him. So like how can you take offence to it when it's true? Like, if you're going to take offence to it, sure, tee off the men's tee box off. <laughs> Come on, away way back 30 yards, love. <laughs> like, I don't, I don't understand how you can take offence to it when it's true. Like, it, like, you, like, do you know what I mean? Like, she was given out in the article about how, oh, he's suggesting women can't drive the ball as far as men. Yeah, but... Like, but you have a separate tee box, you can't, like. You literally, we changed the rules <laughs> in the game <laughs> because you can't do that, like. And now you're giving out stink. I, I don't it's get true. it dude I it don't get true. it it's outrageous boy <laughs> they're just looking for things to be given out about Nola it annoys me it annoys me I'm all for equal like but like <laughs> you said that like a foreigner <laughs> I am all for equal <laughs> <laughs> not even opportunities or just equal just boy. be equal, equal like, yeah, yeah. do you know what I mean but yeah. it annoys me boy when they're just this stupid like if if t- if that grow if that grilled you up like if you if that got you going now Tiger Woods passing Justin Thomas the two boys having a little joke get a life get a life like honestly yeah, like, yeah. if that's annoying you yeah. like there's things happening this time a hundred years like, ago people were in fucking trenches eating mud and shit yeah. and rats for breakfast like you know what I mean now we're getting offended by yeah. what a golfer does to another golfer yeah. who are two multi-millionaires yeah having a laugh with each other yeah absolutely and do you know what if something's funny to someone leave them off like as long as it's not hurt physically harming anybody. And like I always find that about humour. But and, and if someone finds it funny, don't get offended that they found it funny. Sure, Jesus, yeah. laughter sometimes is actually you can't help it. 100%. I'm like I shouldn't be laughing at that shit, but you're laughing, lad. Yeah. So like sometimes it, like, you laugh because you shouldn't be laughing. Yeah. Like it's the fact I shouldn't be laughing is what's making me laugh. But in this situation like that, like it's like it's a private joke between the two boys that obviously was zoomed in and caught like and it's like it's not like he came out and, and said anything bad like he's literally having a joke with one of his buddies and because there's 50 cameras on him um, it gets highlighted and then they're on about he's like yeah I just think oh I don't have time for it but no. I don't have time for it I'm actually disappointed I even read the article yeah it's one of those yeah do you hear uh, things that uh, also things I don't even want to hear about anymore Shakira or uh, PK and his new girlfriend got kicked out of a restaurant because the owner loves Shakira stuff that's coming up on my fucking feed like you know and I, I wish I could cancel that like just stop showing me shit in the two of them like you know what I mean I couldn't yeah. give a fuck like yeah. do you know what I mean oh, I couldn't care less but I actually like there was there was couldn't care less <laughs> um, <laughs> random random question kid random question okay. what talent do you wish you had ooh so if you could pick anything out there to be like do you know what I'd love to be good at that or do you know what I'd love to have that skill, talent, the knack for that or whatever, what would it be? Tough question, boy. Um, what would I like? What, would I, what talent would I like? I'm shit at fixing things, boy. I'm shit at making things, fixing things. Every man and my, um, and, and my mam and dad side of the family is like that. Like, do you know what I mean? You've met both uncles on both sides, my father, everybody, I'm, every man in my family. We're all gas fucking men, like, but none of us can actually do anything. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I mean? Like, not that, like, they all work and are successful in whatever they do, like, but I'm just saying. With your hands. Exactly, like, we would have to call someone over for the light bulb, like, mm. do you know what I mean? If something goes off, like, Dad is very impressed for very little technology happening, like, he'd be like, wow, how would you do that, like, it's like <laughs> HDMI one, do you know what I mean, like, <laughs> it's that kind of stuff, like, so, I don't know, like, I suppose, yeah, being a bit more of a handyman, being my mm. brain understanding that, but then again, would my brain work in the way I wanted to now? If that was the case, I often find people that are like that, very pragmatic with fixing things and doing things and making things, that they mightn't, whatever other side of the lobe, they mightn't actually use it. Um, mm. I always would have liked to have been good at hurling, but then what the fuck would that have done? Um, Mend you up a bit. Mend me up a small bit, boy. I might be a bit stocky. I might eat more, do you know? Um, so what talent, what skill do I wish I had? Uh, being more handsy makes sense, but yeah. Just yeah, be just more be, more, be a bit more handsy. I'm shit with my hands, but I'm shit at me. But you see, you, you see, I, I think myself just from just from knowing you that um, you you think that and you run with it, and then that prevents you from actually having a go off. Okay. Like, do you know Why have you seen me fix things and build things? No, I've seen you not do it. Though. Yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? And they'd be <laughs> like, "Well, do you know what you do? Stop thinking so much and just start doing it." Kid. Right, right, right. Do you know what I mean? Because right. it comes with instructions and the tools <laughs> and the screws. Yeah. So then, like, but kid, what'll happen? Right, I'll start doing what you'll say. Right. 
this first or second hurdle, kid. Do you know the frustration of not being able to do something? And it's telling you to do it, kid. Yeah, yeah. It's telling you, oh, here's step one, step two, get yeah, down. I yeah. can't do it. I can't do it. <laughs> Everyone else can. And I can't. Some people can do it without it. Some people can just look and do it. And I've lost four pieces. <laughs> it's all fucking guy. So why would I put myself under any of that? I, I have enough things to feel yeah. bad about now. Kid, I get down on myself. Like, I, I could cry, like. Do you know what I mean? Ah, leave it alone, getting yeah. cuddled. Like, ah, you're not stupid. <laughs> I'm fucking stupid. That shit will start. <laughs> kid. I swear to God, boy. People consoling me, like, yeah. do you know what I mean? You're so it's just not good for my mental health, boy. Yeah. Kicking shit and... You're going to have some amount of that shit, no, with the babble, boy. Oh, my God. I know, yeah. Everything comes and, like, you buy this thing online, it's literally that big. It's that big. It comes in 58 pieces, kid. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like it, like a four hours, seventy-two step instruction list mm. on how to put this little thing together. Like, yeah. what a waste of life! I'd be taking it fucking over to your house, lad. <laughs> <laughs> um, so this question would have been easy fifteen years ago, but as a fully grown man, who do you know look up the most to? <sighs> so obviously, when we're young men, like there's plenty of people we could think of that we look up to, whether it be sporting people or actual people in our own circles or I look up to yeah but as a fully grown man it's a different question yeah so as a fully grown man i suppose you just take inspirations from a few people and try to carry that in like you know obviously your your father's obviously the first one and the constant one like mm. you know what i mean if you're lucky enough do you know what i mean to have a good relationship with your dad i suppose which i do so yeah i would say i would say him um good answer um but then loads of things, but you might get it. You might get it from a comedian. You might get it from a thing you watch a football or. Do you know what I mean? You you're a full grown man now, so you've a shape of what you would like to be anyway. Mm. Or you've set morals and standards from yourself. You've made a bunch of mistakes. You've done things you don't like, taking jobs you don't like, taking. Do you know what I mean? Everything you made a thousand mistakes. A girlfriend you don't like. All this kind of stuff, right? And now, no, with all those mistakes, you'd like to see what kind of man you are. So I don't know. Is it? Did I have that guy? I want to be like that guy? Or is it like, I know the type of guy I can become? Do you know what I mean? To look up yeah, to... I, I look up to the guy. That sounds weird, no? Like, But like, do you know... I suppose looking up may, maybe means like I'd like to aspire to be at his level. Where I wouldn't have that now. Mm. There's no like... Like when you talk about footballers, some footballers are fucking younger than me now. Some mm. footballers, I even think about their lives. Yeah, they have millions like... But they're tick fucking stupid. Yeah, like, yeah. Does their girlfriend really fucking love them? Like, yeah, do you know yeah. what I mean? All that kind of stuff. So yeah. I don't know what I swap. But to answer your question, yeah, I kind of I know what how the best version of me and what good morals and stuff like that. Like, do you know what I mean? So I suppose throughout life you you take that. So yeah, no one in particular, kid. No one in particular, bits, but bits from bits from a hundred people. Yeah, that right. I like. You know? And it could be someone different. Like, there's things I respect as well. And Joe, you know, I like I like pure character acts and people as well. Like, you know. Yeah. Um, anybody to overcome anything, anybody to go through hardship. I often wonder, like, sure, Jesus Christ, I was born in perfect scenarios. In a perfect scenario. Do you know what I mean? Had everything I wanted, did whatever I wanted, mm. no hardship whatsoever, like, you know, and loved. Do you mm. know that kind of way? And then I often see people turn out amazing, like, mm. and they didn't have a fraction of that, like. Yeah. So I wouldn't actually have to be celebrities. If I name them, they probably wouldn't know them and know them. Yeah. But, like, it would be little bits of that. And I wouldn't even have to be a friend of them or acquaintance. It's like, I fucking respect that. I admire that. And if I could have a bit of that steel, I'd be happy because I had everything. They didn't. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So Good answer. Yeah. Good answer. Um, totally random questions, obviously. Uh, can you remember who your first crush was? Uh, mm. and, first and, how crush. and how old were you? Yeah, boy. I actually can't remember what she looks like, obviously. I just remember the name and coming home, 10 and my mum that I fancied a girl called Stacy in play school. Play school. Play school, kid. So totally that's when right. we go on about, like, yeah, oh, are you born gay? Are you not born gay? I didn't know what love or anything was or to be attracted to anybody, but I liked a girl named Stacy. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I like four. Three or four, yeah, yeah. And yeah. fancied the uh, play school teacher, Caroline. Yeah. I remember we were on holidays in, like, Wales, and I brought her back a keyring. And, like, we were months from going back to play school. I was like, yeah, I need to yeah. get deaf for Caroline. Like, yeah. Yeah. My, my dad's like, you're a psycho. That's, that's adorable. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so, yeah. That's adorable. Yeah. That's fucking adorable. Um... Is there any, or who, which fictional character do you most relate to? So, which fictional character? Which fictional character? Yeah, vibes most with you in, in terms of yourself. Who, who do you most relate to, do you think? Be Rabbit out of 8 Mile. <laughs> 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 you that answer. ready, like you know, you that yeah. fucking ready. He's thought about like. that, like he has thought about yeah. that, like that's, um, that's brilliant, boy. John Caulfield, boy, the brilliant. green mile. 
<laughs> Which fella is he then? He's the guy locked up getting so he's the, he's the big black villain so oh, okay, like, right. yeah, yeah, with yeah, the mouse. Yeah. Oh he's healing the yeah, 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 <laughs> How yeah, could yeah. that be me? Like trapped yeah, yeah. huge man that's trapped yeah. in his hill. <laughs> that can heal people. Yeah, yeah, that can heal. Wrongly convicted. <laughs> There's notions of himself yeah. like yeah, yeah. Edward Give me, your, <laughs> give me your hand, Bob. <laughs> yeah, boy. I'll fix your mouse. And yeah. what fictional character? So th- there was a theory in that thing that like the, it was in there ab- about Jesus Christ and that film. Wasn't that the whole... Like y- your man was, you know, been getting blamed for stuff he didn't do. He was like wrongly convicted. His initials were JC. He was performing miracles. There's like something in the Green Mile about like the, the main character being referenced mm. some G- what a what a show anyway it's a cracking yeah. show yeah. I haven't seen it in years What's and I guess 9-11 Mil- was an inside jingles. job then <laughs> 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 couldn't couldn't wrap his head around it like <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bo Jingles was that the most was, was it him um, yeah something yeah 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 yeah. but I actually can't remember your man was a sick sick man though, the fella that didn't put the water on the oh sick dude man. dude what a way out as well yeah what a way out like okay what fictional character? You'd pick the firing squad, I'd say, would you? If I had to go down? Yeah. Grace me. Uh, yeah, well, well, yeah, would you? Yeah. But the fucking English. <laughs> <laughs> if I had to put me down. Yeah, I always say, I've, I've said this in the podcast, an Italian man, boy. Give an Italian man yeah. one week and he d- I don't tell me when he's going to murder me. I just know he's going to murder me yeah. that week. That's fucking, That's, it's so poetic. It's, it's brilliant, awesome. kid. It's, it's brilliant. You it's motherfucker. Awesome. Like, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Are you brushing your teeth? <laughs> we had a great time with him now, but he's going to do you right at your happiest yeah. time. Yeah. Well, at least expect. Yeah. Did they respect you going out, boy? Yeah. I'd make a quick Let's clean. go for a spin. Like. Let's go for a spin. Yeah. Sit in the front seat. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't you? Don't you? Yeah. You don't probably. There's no problem. There's no problem. Forget about it. Everything. You don't worry about that. Yeah. So yeah, an Italian man have to hang out with him for a week, and he has to murder me during that week. He can kill me straight away, very last day. Yeah. I just don't know what's coming. It's it's actually it's actually beautiful. I I yeah, yeah. It's a great way up. I reckon if I like had lost my faculties now when I was about one hundred and twenty, no one around me, time was up. Like yeah, you just see a guy coming. Down an Italian dude. A beautiful Versace suit, like yeah. coming down the hall. Like, hey, yeah. how you doing, Danny? Yeah. How you doing? You're not feeling too good. <laughs> hmm? You ain't feeling too good. Hey, take two of these. You be out like a fucking light. How you, how you feeling now? You feel good? <laughs> take that, you motherfucker! <laughs> Jimmy the Hat sends his fucking regards, you fucking mutt. Take that. And here's for... This one's for Tony. <laughs> Kicking him into the head. A violent debt. Like, you were only an old man. You could have gone out yeah. smooth. Like, I had to do violent. Yeah. Like. Go yeah. with a bang, kid. Go with a bang. Go with a bang. Yeah. If we're going to go, go. Like. You motherfucker. Do you actually remember that st- um, scene from Goodfellas when um, they had to hide their money? They had to not spend it, like... And your man was like, uh, don't spend any of this money for like fucking three months yeah, to feds yeah. rent us. And your man arrives up anyway. His wife is a fur yeah, jacket. A fucking a pink purple, Cadillac. A, p- <laughs> a purple pink Cadillac. <laughs> Isn't she a beauty? Your man's <laughs> fucking losing it. Like. Yeah. But like that scene there, like uh, <laughs> Main City getting done for... Uh, yeah, you mean, yeah, like, yeah, Meanwhile, yeah. Chelsea, like, <laughs> you went off like, Isn't she a beauty, boys? <laughs> <laughs> they are unreal, unreal. Yeah. What a D- show! The um, is. Yeah, it's what unbelievable. Show. It's one of those. It's on every night, and if you if you stumble, go past it, you'll end up yeah. watching the whole thing every time. Like. Yeah, it's iconic. Like, yeah. Do you ever see? Do you know what you'd like? It's a bit slower, but it's very good. Uh, a Bronx Tale. It's on Netflix. It used to be on Netflix. No, anyway. I've heard of it and I've passed it, but I've never actually watched Brilliant. it. Brilliant. Is it, yeah? Brilliant. Is that a that scene um, there where, where I actually when I, it actually came out when I said I don't want him looking at our fella. I was like Joe yeah, Gomez. Yeah. I don't even want Joe Gomez yeah, looking at Sella. Yeah. Like, is it Marlon Brando or something? No, no, there's a guy named Sonny. Sonny. But there's a guy in a call. Do you know the way in Italian films are at the start? They'll give this unbelievable intro where you get yeah, all yeah, these yeah. names of Italian yeah, people. Yeah. And it's from the start, you know who everybody is. Yeah. It'll be a nice jingle. Here's yeah. Frankie Four Fingers. All eating at the dinner. Yeah, 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 yeah. Johnny Two Times. I gotta go get the papers. Get the papers. Moves <laughs> on. Moves <laughs> on. Fucking true. Like, you know. So Sam in the Bronx Tale kind of goes through their bar at the start, like, you know. And the Jinx. There's a guy called the Jinx, like. And he hasn't won a bet in 30 fucking years, like, you know what I mean? Yeah, he's yeah. always, he's always looking at me, he's like, fuck. And then it's like, the Yankees are winning, like, they're all watching, he goes, they're going to fucking win. And then the, yeah. the Jinx walks <laughs> in, he goes, I bet the fucking Yankees. And they all go, <laughs> they're all like that, like, you know what I mean? And the boy's going to lose, like, you know. But uh, that happened, the kid, the, like, in the show, Robert De Niro's character as a child, comes walking for Sonny in the bar, and they're all gambling out back. But the kid is lucky, like the kid's throwing dice and all the things are coming up. And they're like, throw another one, throw another one. And now the Jinx wants to have a, have a, have a bet with the kid, like to help the kid. Yeah. Like, and they're like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> like, they go, you get in the fucking, put him in the bathroom. Put him in the fucking bathroom. I don't even want to look at this fucking kid. It's fucking 
excellent, mate. It's fucking Brilliant. excellent. Yeah, so the jinx, that's what Joe Gomez is, no, the jinx. Yeah, it's a fact. But yeah, watch a Bronx tale, lad. It's so good. And the music, mm. the music, kid. It's all fucking a cappella, fucking yeah. true subway beats. And it's pure like Italian. Yeah, it's unbelievable. If you like Goodfellas, yeah. you'd love this. It's Sounds unreal. Good. Yeah, and it's all morals as well. It's kind of like you test yourself at the end of it. It's like, was he good? Was he bad? Yeah. What What, what, what are we watching here? Like, yeah. it's good. Like, you know. Brilliant. The best of shows make you root for the bag, don't they? It's yeah. like, how, have I, how am I rooting for this serial yeah. killer? Like Tony Montana. Somehow the like story. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? You fuck. Yeah. <laughs> you in a restaurant. Take yeah. a look at that. Make it a sick. <laughs> Take a look at that bad guy, man. <laughs> you fuck. <laughs> My wife's fucking warm us up a load of... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fucking yeah. Giving her socks. Yeah. Like, even at the end, though. I fucking with the with the fucking coke. Yeah, like you actually yeah. want him to die, didn't it? It's like yeah. my heart is yeah. gonna pop from watching he's this dude. It both. goes into montages yeah. like he's there drinking snort and I was yeah. like, Oh god, like yeah. but yeah, they're the best shows. Do you see Casino? Broke his own rules, like you know, like the, the rules at the start they're all like don't get high in your own yeah. supply and don't whatever and it just shows the the change over the years. Um Casino, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. um I got a tag on that. Sorry, that's an <laughs> broke his own rules, that's Tony Montana against Scarface. Uh yeah, yeah, by casinos, they're brilliant. The, they're the best of shows, kids. Yeah, Didn't so, Bronx Tale for you, kid. Yeah, Go I'll watch get that. on that. Um, what are we looking at? I'll get on that. Oh, lads. Yeah, we better flake it on, kid. Yep. All right, guys, thanks very much for listening. We have to go to a gig. Uh, yeah, peace and love, yeah. Thanks, Dan. Thanks for having me, kid. Peace and love, yeah. Peace and love.